guys, and welcome back to episode 3 of Let's Play Tales of Fantasia. As always, I'm your host, Exodus. Okay, so last time we were making our way through the mountain path, the incredible uh, encounter rate. Um, like I said, I don't think there's anything too great at the end, but I want to show it to you guys anyway. I'd like to get a lot of the chests. Uh, I'd like to get all the chests, really. I'm pretty sure it's a life bottle and an orange gummy. Orange gummies heal TP, which is your, you know, your technique points. Uh, yeah, guys, I still have free time. I'm kind of bored, so I'm going to hang out with you guys. You're my go-to guys, you know what I mean? Okay, my, uh, the second video in this, uh, in this series is actually, uh, uploading right now while I'm playing this. Um, so again, I hope you guys enjoy these as much as I enjoy making them. Alright, owls. Again, it's, this is where Chester was great to have because of his bow and arrow. Alright, let's take you out. Okay. Alright. The battle system in this was definitely improved uh, in the GBA version. Uh, again, I never played the PlayStation version, so I can't comment on that. Alright. Another B. Okay. Here. Oh, I hate fighting these guys. Without another party member that knows, like, magic or something, because they, uh, Kles's, uh range is pretty annoying. But when he gets more skills, though, he becomes, you know, the greatest fighter ever. Okay, let's move up. And damn it! Right. If you notice that little S marker that was above the enemy's head, that right there, uh, it just it's just telling you that they're short. Right now you're in short range, so right now I would do uh, dual kick. Maybe I'll do that right now. There we go. Instead of getting my ass handed to me. Telling you, they did this. They definitely set this one up on purpose because I don't remember the random encounter rates in the entire game being like this. So in the GBA version, the bonus dungeon, I remember the random encounter rates being a beast. All right, so again, let's keep moving. We're almost there. Every two steps, we get in a fight, but you know, we're we're doing all right, guys. Dual kick. Take them out. Watch the bee. Again, the bees aren't too hard. They're one hit kills. Right, we got another apple gummy. Okay, let's move up here. Oh my god, guys. This is insane. Are they serious? Oh, thank god it's just the bee enemies, though. Alright, six experience. And four gold. Okay, let's move up. Ah, oh, finally here, but we're still going to get in a ton of random encounters. And we were ambushed. Let's take out the bee. Let's fire off a scion bolt. There we go. Get some more percentage for that one. And I've actually started setting a timer, so that's useful, right guys? Alright, 13 experience. What time is it? Oh man, i got to leave soon. Actually, I have an appointment. Ah, life bottle. Fantastic. And a random battle. What a surprise. But they're bees, so we'll be alright. Scion bolts? Alright. An apple gummy. I think I should level up soon, right? Yep, I'm leveling up soon. Orange gummy found. Now, the good part is you don't have to walk through there. This little exit to the, uh, to the left that you're going to see in two seconds, uh, that takes you right out to the world map. Kill the bee. Another bee. These egg bears. Just bug bears. I call them egg bears. Haha. <laughs> Those are from future games. 
Uh, they carry clubs for some strange reason. They fashion themselves weapons. Okay, now let's get the hell out of here. Oh my god, this is nuts. Okay. Alright, one down. We're getting better. And let's take this owl out. Whoop. Fifteen experience, alright. Okay. We finally made it out of the forest path. I'm shocked, guys. We actually did it. Alright, well, let's leave my Marvel alone and uh, start moving up to Euclid. Right here, you can see the bridge is taken out, so Euclid's really the only place where you can go, so let's go. Uncle Olsen's house is in the northwest end of town. Okay, so northwest. Let's do a little exploring first, though, since you don't have to worry about random battles. Whose house did I just barge into? I need to be careful with all of my UV rays when I go outside. Ah, oh, you dumb. Crazy broad. No, I'm just kidding. I love one. Hey, let's go watch the juggler. Alright, let's do it. Okay, I know what I really want to buy here is a, uh, a set of jet boots. They're extremely useful. Okay, there's the end. Euclid days in. Eh, right now, nothing really important here. Let's wrap around this way. Telling us that the item shop and stuff is over here. The item shop. Talk to the man at the counter if you want to buy something. How can I help you? Anything useful? No. We don't need anything. Excuse me, ma'am. Okay, now what's down here? Up here is nothing. Okay. Ah, the weapon and armor shop. Um... You still don't want to buy yourself any weapons, uh, because you're gonna lose whatever weapon you buy. So, it's best to just... There's... That's what we need, right there. So, it's best to just hold off on buying stuff for now. I don't remember if they just take your weapon or if they take everything, but I know they don't take your accessories and the jet boots. And now, guys, we can run! Oh, thank God. Excuse me. Excuse me! Sorry, I was daydreaming. Yeah, we're gonna leave all that stuff for now. Thank you, please come again. I keep forgetting we can run now! Woo! Let's go this way. This is the food shop. Welcome! What are you looking at? Behind you. What? Ah! Can the other merchants keep the damn pets out of my store? Oh, I guess not. Hello. Bread, creamy cheese. Let's see. Right, we'll buy some bread. Buy, like, some steak. You know what I mean? Make some nice sandwiches out of that. Nothing really important here. I heard that a man in black armor left you clear with some soldiers. I wonder what they're doing. Well, they're raising my town. That's what's happening. What am I going to cook for dinner tonight? Okay, here you go. Here's a little street vendor. Now, what you want to do is the rod here for ten gold. You definitely want to get one of those. Other than that... Um, yeah, nothing really useful yet. We'll get there, though. We'll get there. Okay, that's an exit to town. There are lots of dark clouds in the southern sky. It must be raining pretty hard. Whoop, don't want to exit. Where's that juggler? I believe this is Uncle Olsen's house. I don't want to go there quite yet. There's the juggler. Hey you, why not stop and watch my performance? It won't hurt to stop and watch. Why not take a load off? Why don't you back off? Alright. Check out the circus performer. Wahahaha, that's so funny. Alright. Let's check my equipment, actually. Yeah, I'll wait to buy some equipment till later. I don't think I need it right now. Hello, is anybody home? Cl 
Bless my nephew! Uncle, it's been too long since I visited. Class, you've grown so much! I heard Totus has been attacked, is it true? How did news get here that fast? Yes, both my parents were killed. I was afraid of that. I'm glad that you're safe. I don't know what to do, Uncle. You can stay here as long as you like, Class. Thanks, Aunt Joan. I'll try not to be a burden. Alright, so now let's just hang out with, the, with my uncle. Please rest here. No, not yet. Ah, right, so I understand. Just don't work too hard. Class, please try to cheer up. Alright. Uncle also got a pretty nice dig. Yeah. He's got a nice pad. I believe this leads to... Yeah, this is the bedroom, and this is the exit. Curious to see something, guys. If I take the long sword off, I wonder... Alright, let's see if that works, guys. Just a little test I want to run, because I never actually did that. Let's walk down here. And I think I'm going to take my uncle up on that rest. Wherever my uncle is right now. Uncle Olsen, there you are. Cross my name, please have a rest. Yeah. This should progress the story. That night. Oh, you old bastard. Poke, poke. Oh! Uncle, what's going on? Class, I'm sorry. If I didn't tell them, they would slaughter the whole city. Please forgive me. If you cooperate, we won't have any trouble. This really isn't my day. Ah, oh, watch where you're poking that thing, alright? Move it. Man. Just trying to get some sleep and shit. Uncle Olsen, you old bastard. I'm so sorry, cuz. Bastard. Someone's coming. What are they coming back for? Amy, I will have my revenge. Oh, this is ominous. Looks like a castle Magus would hang out in. We have our vain son, sir. Good work. How foolish Miguel was to leave the pen with such a weakling. It was you who attacked Totus, wasn't it? That's none of your concern. I'm only interested in you for one reason. Yoink. Hey, give that back! The second pendant is mine. Guards, take him to the dungeon and lock him up. I'll decide his fate later. Ha ha ha, finally, they're mine. And you'll notice that little strange image in the reflection in the mirror. They point it out to you. Something's in the mirror. What's going on here? And that beeping was my timer that I remembered to set this time, right? I'm starting to remember all this stuff. And what a surprise, an RPG where you get locked in a dungeon. Get in there! Move it! We'll come back and finish you off later. Now what? Alright guys, this is a good place to stop. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Tales of Fantasia. And as always, this is your host X signing out. And remember guys, always keep on laughing.